Leap and the Net Will Appear is more than just an album title for Jeremy McComb. It's a way of life in the music business. We had a chance to chat with Jeremy at a CD release party for that new album to talk about what a wild ride he's had in making it. Hi, I'm Kelly Lynn, and we are here today catching up with Jeremy McComb, and he's going to let us in on his success. You've got a lot of cool things going on. Yeah. Tell us, I mean, first of all, tonight you're doing a big show, your yes. album release party. Yes, very excited about it. You know, we're, uh, we're actually right now, we're working on some, uh, uh, getting our feet up. We're simulcasting our live show here from Nashville, Tennessee, out to uh, all across the world. We've had uh, people that have come on and have watched our shows online, and these things have kind of just... Uh, They've just multiplied. You know, it started very small, and they've gotten bigger and bigger and bigger. And uh, and uh, that was kind of the start of funding the record and doing the new record. And uh, just came out, so we're doing the release party here from the Rutledge. Now, the record basically was funded by your fans, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, hundred percent funded by the fans. That was the coolest part about it. Was uh, you know, I think that the system, you know, in Nashville, it works for some people and for others, it takes uh, different avenues. And so for me, it was one of those things where I'd always had a great fan base, and uh, even. Even when I was done with publishing deals and done with major label deals, I was still touring. I was still doing nothing but making music, and that's because of my fans. So uh, we did a thing on Kickstarter.com, which uh, funded the whole record, and uh, this is their party tonight for them. So. I'm excited about it. How fun. Now, your single time. Yes. Tell us about it. You co wrote that? Yeah, I co wrote it with my buddy Casey Timmer. And, uh, you know, we were just uh, we were talking about how funny it is that at the end of your life you get a little dash and a piece of uh, marble, you know, that explains an entire life lived. And that's just kind of how the idea started. And we sent it out to some folks out of radio and uh, sent it around to some friends and have gotten a lot of great feedback on it. So I'm excited to see what happens with it. It's time and it's time to take it because it's mine and I ain't going to wait. Tonight, the show is going to be on stage it, and yes. also you're going to be doing it obviously live here for everyone. Mm -hmm. What songs are you going to do? Everything on the album, yeah. of course, and then yeah, we're just going to we're going to go down through the whole record and give a chance uh, for everybody, give everybody a chance to hear the whole record live from top to bottom, and uh, and throw it out there on the internet and let folks that you know can't make it because you have fans that are in Maine and fans that are in England and fans that are in Australia that don't get a chance to come watch you live. So um, it's one of those things where uh, I'm excited that stage it came on board. And, and Kickstarter and uh, Fireball has been an amazing sponsor for me and so they're sponsoring it tonight with Epiphone and uh, they're helping us do it so it's just been an incredible deal you know Every day I wake up. Where did you come up with all of these ideas? Because it seems to me that you've pretty much been your own entrepreneur and you've got it going on. I mean, the fans know about you, your music's getting out there, you're successful. For all those people watching that are like, how does how's he do it? They're waiting on someone else to help them. How'd you do it? I think, you know, once you get past the point of, uh, of depending on other people to make things happen for you, it's, you know, hey, if you want to play, go play. Go out and make fans. Go play in coffee houses. Go play, you know, if people say you can't play, play outside. You know, and really that's where Leap in the Net will appear, which is the name of my new record, uh, uh, came from. Because it's like, you know, sometimes you just got to jump and build your wings on the way down, you know. So that's what we've been doing, and, and so far it's been working. I heard uh, Matt Nathanson say one time that uh, some artists take the elevator to the top and some artists take the stairs. So. Uh, I feel like we're taking the stairs, you know. All right. Well, <laughs> slow and easy, that's a good way. And if your music's great, it'll make its way. Put your faith out there and, uh, and jump, see what happens. Thank you so much Thank for you all so your work, You're for awesome. your music, and for talking to us on Inside Music Road, Jeremy McComb. The truth is I know it's my fault. What I didn't do is coming through the walls. It's loud and clear. Now it's time for our weekly songwriter tip brought to you by Nashville Songwriters Association International. This week we sit down with George Tarrant as he talks about using repetition in your music. I keep bleeding, I keep, keep bleeding love. I keep bleeding, I keep, keep bleeding love. Cool cadence, great melody, economy of words. Great song concept. I've never heard Bleeding Love before, but I know exactly where the artist is coming from. Great use of repetition. They had me from the first chorus. Went out and had to buy the song. Wish I'd have written it. 
To learn more about NSAI, visit NashvilleSongwriters.com. That's about all the time we have for this week's show, but don't forget those holiday CD DVD projects we have up for grabs from the Skaggs family. If you want to enter for your own copy, you have to go online to InsideMusicRoad.com and click on the link for free music. Don't forget to check out our Facebook page, too, for all the latest news and events going on around town. We're going to leave you this week with a special holiday hit from that live performance with Ricky and his family. Here is Let It Snow. Until next time, I'm Bailey for Inside Music Row, and I'll see you again real soon.